Coaches, this video is for the mom on your team that always complains about white uniforms and white pants. I'm looking at you, Nelly. And also for the parents who want to learn how to clean white baseball pants with absolutely zero extra effort. Like, I don't scrub, I don't power wash, I do none of that. Like, I just I just wash these pants like I wash a regular load of white laundry and they come out looking fresh and bright and uh, renewed. So we won our bracket this weekend and in celebration, some of the boys decided to belly flop in the mud that accumulated at home plate. Uh, so what I'm doing here is I'm just hosing off the clumps of dirt because I don't want clumps of dirt in the ground stuck in my washing machine, but I normally wouldn't even do this to pre-treat at all. Don't come for me, my house was built in the 60s and I'm convinced that this washing machine was probably here from the very beginning, but here is the next step in the process. Get your, your pants laid out and, and this is it's really just a, a couple of step process. It's pretty easy. I'm not scrubbing, I'm not doing anything. I'm going to get this Don power wash stuff. I'm just going to spot spray on the pants. I'm not going to scrub. I'm just going to spray it. This bottle actually ran out, so I didn't even have as much as I usually do. And I don't always do this. I just do it sometimes. And I'm doing it today because, like I said, he went crazy. Now, drop your Tide Pot in or whatever kind of laundry detergent that you use. Yeet! I dropped my pants in there already, too. This is the secret sauce right here. Come closer. This is the stuff. This is what you need. I got a half cup there for measuring the out white bright. That is the key. That's doing all the work. So I'm going to put a half cup in here. Make sure you close your mouth. You're not a mouth breather like you're from Kentucky. Sorry, Kentuckians. I'm from Indiana. Uh, you don't want to breathe this stuff in. It's kind of gross. Uh, but you're going to put a half cup of that in your washer. And I'm going to put it on the soak setting. It's going to like basically just sit there in warm water for 20 minutes. And some laundry sanitizer, about a half cup of this because this boy stank and it is the only way to get the odor out of his clothes after he plays sports. Kentucky, I have no idea how you ended up catching a stray there. My bad. If you're from Kentucky or Indiana, you understand the rivalry. All good. Now, I just did the uh, regular load that I would normally do now after I did the soak, uh, which is basically like a 12 minute regular wash. And here we are. As I said, don't come for me. It's a laundry room and a mud room. It's dirty. This is the finished product. It's not dried yet, but uh, it is fresh out of the washer. And as you can see, belly flops didn't matter. Pants are clean. They're actually pretty bright white. I did not scrub. I did not power wash. I did nothing special. Stop complaining. 